Welcome to my lab. I'm Kylie Guzman, a Pearson Campus Ambassador, and I'm here to give you a quick tour of the MyLab experience. This tour will help you learn about all the key MyLab features to help you succeed in your course. So let's get into this course. When you enter your course, you'll land on the course home, where you will see a snapshot of everything you need to know, including any announcements from your instructor, and all upcoming assignments displayed in both calendar and list view. You will also see any past due assignments here. To work on an assignment, you can click on an assignment name or on the left-hand menu under student to-do list. When doing homework, students often rely on our learning aid features, which are included for many questions. Look for the available learning aids in the bottom left corner of the question screen. Let me show you two examples from two different titles. This first example is from an operations management MyLab course, which includes more math-based problems. AI study tools offer AI-supported guidance to help you find the correct answer and are available for select questions. Help Me Solve This breaks down a problem into pieces so you can solve it part by part. You will typically see this for more calculation or math-based problems. E-text pages take you right to the appropriate pages in your e-textbook to help you find the relevant topical coverage you need. View an example offers a similar worked problem you can read through. And finally, Ask My Instructor lets you raise issues on specific questions. Once your instructor receives this, they can respond to you or forward it on to the publisher if need be. This second example is from a title on Introduction to Business, my lab course, which includes more conceptual questions and a different set of learning aids. Here, you can find AI study tools offer AI-supported guidance to help you find the correct answer and are available for select questions. E-text pages take you right to the appropriate pages in your e-textbook to help you find the relevant topical coverage you need. And Ask My Instructor lets you raise issues on specific questions. Once your instructor receives this, they can respond to you or forward it on to the publisher if need be. You can see your grades on a single assignment or all your MyLab work by clicking into the student gradebook on the left-hand menu. Keep in mind the overall score you see here may not represent your total score in the course because my lab may only be a portion of your total grade. Make sure you check your instructor syllabus for their grading policy. You can even click into review individual assignments to see what you got wrong and why to help you improve for the future. Often students review past assignments to help prepare for a test. Here's a glimpse of what it looks like when you click into review. You can see the questions you answered previously, which you got right and what you got wrong. A lot of data is shown here, including the time you spent on an assignment, as well as when you worked on it. You can access your Pearson e-textbook by clicking on e-textbook in the left-hand menu and then clicking on Launch eTextbook located right here. It will take you over to your textbook provided with the course. Your Pearson eTextbook includes many useful features, like an audiobook feature where you can have the book read aloud to you, flashcards to test you on key vocabulary and ideas, including the ability to create custom flashcards, highlighting in up to three different colors located here, as well as note-taking, note which are all captured in a digital notebook located over here for you to refer back to. Select titles also include AI study tools, which offer dynamic AI-supported summaries explanations, and practice study sessions based on the material in your textbook. You can also access your e-textbook for this and any other class in all in one place via the Pearson Plus app. 
Next up is the Student Success Hub. Visit this space for news on exciting new features just released in my lab. Plus, there are so many more self-study resources for you here. Let's walk down this menu. The MyLab tour for students is here so that you can re-watch this video anytime you need a refresher. There's also a link to Pearson's student help to solve problems like upgrading temporary access, pop-up blockers, and more. And you can always access askpearsonsupport.com for 24-7 assistance. If you're looking for more practice, check out the personalized study plan, which automatically updates to help you focus on areas where you need help based on how you do on other assignments in the course. Practice on specific topics or learning objectives or quiz yourself to demonstrate mastery. Visit the study plan from the left-hand menu, then go to recommendations to work on the areas where you need to practice on based on the questions you've missed. The all chapters section is also a great place to revisit before an exam. Another study tool that can adapt to your needs is dynamic study modules. Your instructor might assign these for points, but if not, you can still use them on your own to study. You can access them in the student success hub on the left hand menu under dynamic study modules. Then click access dynamic study modules. It will take you to a page that looks like this. First, you need to choose a chapter of content to begin to study. Then you answer questions based on your confidence level, including whether you don't know it at all, if you are unsure about your answer, or if you are sure about your answer. The power of the activity depends on your honest answer. You'll find out if you're right or wrong, and then after a round of eight questions, you'll get some learning feedback to help as you go forward. Students like you say they love this tool and they think it's convenient, easy to use, and very helpful to focus on what matters in their busy schedules. Select titles also include Gapbinder, which helps you assess prerequisite skills to help ensure success in the course. You can also explore and access the Student Career Hub directly from the left-hand menu. This gives you access to Pearson Job Match, which offers a robust collection of career exploration tools, including job postings, sample salaries, industry analysis, and much more. Here's what it will look like once you click on Student Career Hub. Looking for supporting videos, animations, or other resources tailored for this course? Check out the multimedia library within the Student Success Hub on the left-hand menu. This is available in most courses. The multimedia library is searchable by chapter, section, and media type. Did you know you can upgrade to have a print copy of your book? If you bought a combo code, you've already paid for the print version. Go to print offers in the Student Success Hub on the left-hand menu. If you think you paid for a combo code, try clicking the link under redeem a prepaid print textbook. Follow the instructions to get your copy shipped out. If you haven't prepaid for print, you can still purchase a print textbook and you'll receive an unbound three hole punched version sent directly to your address. Returning back to my lab tour for students, if you ever need help, be sure to visit askpearsonsupport.com linked from this page and search our help for learners for tons of resources. Thank you for watching this brief tour. We hope you had a great learning experience with my lab.